back to another video and today I'm going to be explaining to you how to get quick XP and cash in Platinum 5. Well, Bureau 5, sorry. So the first thing is, get a map that you know. So let's say for example you know the desert really well, then go grind the desert a lot. Let's say for example you know the mountain very well, don't go grind the mountain very well because it absolutely sucks and is overrated. But if the stronghold's pretty hard, if you know it though, I'd go for it. Personally, I'd grind the desert a bunch because it's the closest and it takes, like, it's so easy to get in and out of. Especially with the hostages, it's so easy to navigate them. It gives you about, like, I think it's 1250 if you clear out the entire thing with the first wave and the second wave, it's a, a little bit more. But <coughs> yeah, my point is, it's like. 1.5k if you clear out all three waves, well, like 2k actually, and then you get a ton of XP, it's like 1.5k maybe, hang on, let me do math, nah, 1.k, 1k, 1k, uh, roughly 1k anyway, so you're getting 1000 XP per three waves and you're getting 1.2, well 2k yeah, from all three waves. So personally, I grind desert. Um, I'm going to give you some tips and tricks in this video as well. So basically, if I can land, hang on, let me just land over here so I can show you. It's me uh, desert tips and tricks, basically. So if I just, so this is how I would do desert. <coughs> Sorry. I would also go in a Chinook, Black Hawk, or Sea Stone, or whatever the hell the other helicopter is called. Do not go in a Little Bird. It is so awkward to get the hostages in. Anyways, you'll get shot at immediately the second you land, however. Then I would grab your grenade and throw it over there. It's not killed any hostages for me. As you can see, no hostages were harmed. There's already ever is a hostage out near there. So the next thing I would do is do what I'm doing. Just clear them out one by one. Use the wall as cover if they don't if they try and do anything dumb. Always aim for the head as well. Always aim high. You're always gonna see me aiming high in your videos because that's head and that's more damage. Also if you have like if you're doing windows, you can save ammo on windows by using secondary because I'm not sure about you but you typically end up using a lot more ammo on your primary when you're doing windows anyway so i would do exactly what i just did now here it gets a little bit more complicated so i would go to this corner and do that two shots in the head oh there's only one there just for fun i throw that but it's not really necessary it's just for fun for me rarely ever will they um not come so there'll be a couple of people coming around here do that start shooting them all check that start shooting them all reload vitamin because you'll probably be very low and repeat until they're all dead also check this corner for the love of god i should have really used my primary on that however it's fine then i also get behind these boxes just in case reinforcements are coming just gives you some extra cover about five seconds. No, no reinforcements, easy. You have to be really careful on those windows, though. You have to be really careful on those windows. I have died multiple times because they've called back up. Oh, of course! I didn't even magically get that. Yeah, shouldn't have had. Also, Game sound. Hang on, let me turn my desktop audio off from OBS. Game sound all the way up. Stop walking. If you can hear anyone else walking, take cover. Like that. Then I go. This one's probably one of the trickiest. Then go directly under the stairs. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, that's exactly how you die in um, on the desert this is one of the easiest ways to die so 
I'm gonna check this as well. Oh, oh, damn, damn, damn. I did, I did see, I didn't see that. I didn't see that. I didn't see that. As you can hear, footsteps. Why is he going like that? This guy having a mental breakdown or something. <coughs> Sorry. So then he I can manage this, do it. No. I doesn't need to be blind. I forgot about the guy there. Then get behind these boxes. Do not go over there, that's how you die. Get behind these boxes. Aim out. Because reinforcements are coming. Sorry, I'm gonna use my primary. I don't advise doing what I'm doing, but yeah. Alright. So you wanna do real quick kill. Easy. Now if you want you can clear this. I don't advise it because it's likely how you're gonna die. If you're low on ammo and all that, I I personally don't do that because then the next wave comes, and when I'm transporting out hostages, that next wave can be a nightmare. So personally, if you're looking just for that one wave to get that like 1,000 cash now, 1.2k or something, I think it's 1.25k. Oh my god, let me deal with this guy. I completely forgot that guy here. Yeah. Lovely. I took three shots, one, two body shots, one headshot. If you don't do two headshots, it will be three shots. I yeah. So now they'll be going in. Come on, come on, come on. And this mission takes around eight to nine minutes. I would say personally. Yeah. For me, it takes around eight to nine minutes, but that's with me knowing my way around and not role playing it. If I was role playing it, it would take a goddamn longer. It would take a lot longer because I'd have because I'd start all the way over there and sweep it. That's how I'd RP it. But I don't role play it unless I'm with world graphical rifles. Why is my graphics down? Here like that. Yeah. So then you want to go ahead and take these hostages to FOB. Now I know why I know that some of you will be thinking, man. Why did you only take two hostages? Sorry. But there is a limit on how many hostages you can take and follow you at a time, I should say. So, only, so you can only take two hostages back yourself. If you get, like, an alternative account on, get the alternative accounts on before you go to the desert. So get them in your Chenook ready. Then switch them to go get the hostages and all that. Because then when you put them in FOB, you'll get the money for transporting them and I think rescuing them, but I'm not 100% on that. So that's like, that's the, that's what the money is in, transporting hostages, that's where the money's at really. Because it's easy to do and you might as well do it while you're there. Alright, so that's going to be desert, so just go ahead, refill. Grab all your ammo, like this, pick up all those, make sure you're fully healed by using your vitamin, grab all your stuff, vitamin up, whatever the hell you have to do. So that's going to be the end for, for this video, see you guys, peace.